let's talk about the GT while we got it. If you're on the fence <clears throat> on a GT, may this push you over the edge? I think it is, with the latest firmware update, it is the most superb one wheel to date. I think they can add more in the firmware updates later that will make it even better, custom settings and things of that nature. But out of the box right now, if it's got the latest firmware in there, it rides amazingly. Pushback is much better than it once was, so it gives you more confidence at top end speeds, which is so much enjoyable. Lily, when you rode it, what was your take on the hills? Does this thing mob the hills? Or are you mm. afraid of nose diving up hills? What would you rank it? 10 being amazing, one being this thing sucks dirt. What are you giving it? When it comes to hill, like riding on the hills? Yeah, of GTs. I would say it mobs it. It's like an eight out of 10. And the only reason I don't give the extra two points is because of user error. That's all. Okay. <laughs> like it, it is very, I'm so used to the pints, like small foot pads and the GT is wide. It's just a big guy. It's a big guy. So it is it's about a half inch, I think wider. We saw it when we measured it. Yeah. It's so longer. I, it's heavier. I feel a little bit more unstable, which makes zero sense. Holly, I don't like, it makes zero sense. How am I more unstable on a wider one wheel in comparison to the one wheel pint, which is smaller Hard to tell. pads. What do you, Holly? How do you? Well, how do you, like, I just. I mean, I read the GT. I haven't I mean, even no, read but, it. But, but I appreciate. I would appreciate her input in this because because even if she hasn't written it, she could probably still think of something that's like. Okay, give it lay it on. Comprehensible. Well, I just for think me. there's a lot of differences between the GT and the pint that you normally ride, which they made it that way. So. You know, you got the different foot pads that feel different, and they made the tire totally different than what. You know, it's just a different ride. So I think for you, you just got to get used to it a little bit. Yeah, Which, speaking right. of tires, Holly, you Guess bring up a great point. It. And if you all missed it, you've all clamored for it. You've wanted it. You've coveted the ownership of the opposite one-wheel tire for the GT that you own right now, and they've delivered. You can now purchase online at onewheel.com the opposite tire that you possess on your GT right there. Plus, a pint tire you can purchase. Plus, the new tire is sealing. I think it's pretty the sweet. The new what? The tire sealant. Oh, you can buy that. Oh, you can buy sealant. the XR oh. tire there. You can buy the GT tire. Uh, I, and I'm blown away with the cost. The Pine tire is $70, and the GT tire is 106 To me, that's a deal. Because any of the other tires I've gotten, and they're 100 plus. Pine tire is $100 easy. And so to see that the Pine tire from one wheel is cheaper, now I get it. Some of you are like, oh, that's a Pine tire. I don't really like it. That aside, you can now purchase it. That's if pretty you, cool. If you are a GT owner with a treaded tire on it and you want a slick, boom, now you can do it. If you're a, a GT owner and you have a slick on it and you want to try a treaded tire, boom, there you can do it. You can do it boom. now. Just go to onewheel.com and purchase. Then you get you can live both worlds. Then they're tireless tire sealant. Have you tried it? Have, have I'm not we gotten it yet? I've actually. Did you see the infomercial? I did the infomercial. It's so was funny. Very funny. They're funny, creative guys. Yeah, they are. It's so good. I, I love the deal they were running. You can buy two at the same cost of hmm. each. So, like, they were making it sound like it was a deal, but two cost the same price as one. It's clever. <laughs> it's not not to be confused with the buy one, get one free. Right. You buy, buy one, get and you one get the other at one the same at the same cost price. As the first one. Right. Yes. It's, They're funny. Funny guys. Okay. I like that the, the, what they're talking about is you need less of their sealant and it has little rubber matter, matter in there. And it was cool to watch them stab their tire and it fills. I think it's pretty cool. I have never, in all of my tire changings, I've never put sealant in any of my tires. Some of that is because I change it so much. I think it's messy when I'm dealing with it, changing a tire, which we were changing a tire the other day for an XR. We don't normally do this for people outside of those that you see on camera. I changed their tires and that's it. But I took a leap of faith to do this for someone. I said, I see a need and I'll meet that need. You bring your XR here and I'll change it out. Whatever tire you bring. Well, they brought a wow, tire. Wow, so theatrical. And we got into it. We <laughs> tore it apart. Their fenders were cracked and their bumper were destroyed we hooked him up with a new set of bumpers oh we God. gave him some new grip tape because their grip tape was a piece of mess <laughs> Sound like you said grip tape they <laughs> i had to get a grip <laughs> we had to do a lot of things and then we got that tire we got right into the tire that they put in there and they were trying to seal a a a, a hole in their tire and they unloaded an entire bottle of sealant into that tire i'd never it seen so much slime in my life mess don't do that don't use a whole bottle on your tire. Can I just got to stand up for this. Like, seriously. Just tune in. Dial it in here. If you are going to put some sealant in your tire, 
Use little. Less is more, folks, on your tire sealant. Like, use a quarter of the bottle. You're getting really amped about this. Because it was a nightmare. <laughs> it turned, it made the entire. It was a nightmare. Tire one wheel changing experience into a nightmare. Here I am trying to help somebody. I'm about to give them back their one wheel in pieces. The tire sealant got really tacky. It was awful. I can't tell you the brand of tire sealant. It was not any one wheel brand. It was from a, like a car place, they said. So nonetheless, I'm pretty stoked to see one wheel with their new tire sealant i'm gonna get my hands on it i will try it i might even put on an old tire poke a hole in it and see if it actually works for all of you to see if what they've done why are you laughing over there Lil? <laughs> not at you i'm laughing at the chat someone's got a question i don't want i just don't oh you don't want to interrupt it. my rant yeah okay save it then when, save it i was gonna say when you're done i have an inquiry okay but let's stay on the gt because then when we cut this up it all can be easy for me to cut okay. up okay so the gt <laughs> you have tire options now so get on it you don't have to complain about I'm stuck at this. You can now purchase a tire. If you get a flat in your tire, you don't have to send it in. You just order a new tire, change it out. I know some of you are like, well, how do I do that? It's, I don't know. I'm not changing on the GT yet, so I can't answer that question. But I'm sure it's easily done. Okay. So it mobs hills like nobody's business. I can get up in the trail systems here on our property. I can get up hills that I could never accomplish before. It used to be the humble walk of a one wheel in one hand and your head down on the ground because it's like I want to one day, uh, the little engine that could climb a tree or climb a, climb a hill. And you can't. You're walking it up with the GT. <clears throat> Boom, get up it. XRs, all walking behind me. It's like a little bit of applause for the GT. Get the GT, folks. Now, I got to be honest. What are we talking about? I'm so, I'm so, like. <laughs> what? Yeah, I kind of wish, I kind of wish you would have switched me during that. Because I'm just sitting there like. <laughs> you're losing it? Like, you're not hyped on the GT? I'm trying to get these people on the I'm fence about the you. GT. Buy I'm the not, GT. But here's the thing. I'm not on the fence about the GT. I think you should get the GT. I think the firmware update was the final straw for your decision. And so now I'm just sitting here like, you are so entertaining. And you okay. guys have often asked. They often ask you, Scott, yeah. what you would purchase. If you've never had a one wheel, what would you purchase? GT and so hands you're down. saying G GT GT hands all the way. Okay. Like, the whole riding experience there you have is it. so much fun. Fun. My favorite I'm setting in the, the GT, GT is float. Yeah, let's flow, go. flow, flow, not float. Flow. I love it. It just feels so good. I ride that in all the trails. I don't even change it. Like what? Less okay. time I got to be on my phone, the better. I have read a statistic that uh, I agree. Get it out of here. one we or uh, uh, I read a statistic. <laughs> Lily informed me on this a couple weeks ago. iPhone users touch their phone two thousand and six hundred times on an average. That's gross. One of these days, I think I'm gonna count. You're going to? Yeah. I've got to plan it out, though. Hi. So Somebody's giving us a little hype thing in there. Can you see that in hey, the chat? Hey, uh, oh, Johnny go. says let's that go. the liquid death got you all hyped today. Yeah, and I haven't even <laughs> cracked into it yet. It's still closed. Oh, my gosh. That's But, hey, so thank you funny. so much for the five bucks. You're the first one ever <laughs> to give us $5 in this. Wanna, That's amazing. I'm, I'm applauding you. What does that mean? They sent us five bucks for the hype. They're loving on us. Come on. Check All right. it out. Did we leave anything on the table about the GT? I don't we know. We did, man. We that power, a choice. that torque that's in a GT is like none other. You don't get it in the XR. The XR, I, I, I like the XR, but when I get on it, you just can sense the differences in, in the power, in, in, in that torque. All of it is very different in the GT. Uh, I, I, and and uh, now you're starting to see new designs of things coming out. I forget who did it. But somebody just made a GT rail, a custom rail, which is pretty cool to see out there. So third-party stuff is starting to drop. I know the er en Enduro tire from Float Life is going to drop for the GT. So get in Sweet. it early so that you get to the fun of it all. So you're not going like – I know talking to people about the XR situation many years ago when it was like it wasn't exactly right. And people were like – what I, I didn't get in it. I, I came in late. Well, then you don't you don't have the the knowledge to speak about the history of the XR. It's just cool to be at in at ground level. It feels like it's starting to ship a little bit quicker. Somebody the other day said they ordered the the GT with a slick and it came within seven days. Whereas I do think based on my information from all of you that there is a back order on the the GT with the treaded tire just must be a higher mm. volume to that we got back orders thank everywhere. you i do want to say a big thanks to everybody that watches every week on our youtube channel our podcast or you listen to it without you what would be the point it would be just us hanging out in here doing nothing 
subscribe to the channel as we try to pump out as much one wheel content.